Hey guys, I'm back and today I'm going to do my top five neutral lipsticks for fall, but I could only find four that I really like, so I'm going to do another bold lipstick because I found one and I was like, oh yeah, this one I love. So I'll start with that and this is the From Flower Beauty, which is by Drew Barrymore and this is in Rosebud and this mixed with um, Black Rose, which you can see the colors, are what she's wearing on the September issue of In Style. But I think on the cover she might have just been wearing this because there are pictures that they showed that they said she's wearing these two and they looked a little bit darker. But when I asked them on Twitter they said she was wearing both. So I'm not sure, but it looked like she was just wearing rosebud on the cover. And I do like the black rose, but love the fall, or love rosebud. It's like the perfect red. And these are shiny, but they're not like super shiny. And they are so pigmented. This is probably very close to... Um, cherries in the snow. Uh, I have cherries in the snow right here. It's a little more red. This is cherries in the snow and this is rosebud. And this one's definitely shinier, the cherries in the snow. Um, while I'm here, I was saying in my last video, which was the bold love colors, that cherries in the snow well, it's very similar to Love Goddess by um, MAC, which was in the Maryland collection. As you can see, they're all slightly different. Rosebud, Rosebud definitely has the most red in it, but they are pretty similar. So, Rosebud Love, that would be my sixth favorite bold lip color. And now on to the neutral ones, and I'm going to have like a red stained hand for the rest of my life. But it's okay. My first one is a Maybelline Color Whisper in Lust for Blush. It's just a really pretty mauvey pink. I'm going to have to swatch on my right hand. Which is going to be awkward because I am right handed. It's just really nice like everyday pink. Sorry it's really awkward but anywho <laughs> so the other day I went to Kmart which I don't usually go to Kmart because it's not like close to anything and we have like two targets right next to my house basically so no reason to go to Kmart but I was looking for the Milani rose blushes which I haven't found anywhere and they're like going for $50 on Amazon, which is ridiculous because those people bought them for $6. But our Kmart is closing, so everything, all the makeup was 30% off, so I did stock up on some things. And one of the Milani things that I didn't end up picking, ugh, that I ended up picking up is one of their lipsticks in Naturally Chic. And I don't know why I haven't picked this up before because I have a lot of them. I have a lot of the bolder colors. It is a really pretty nude and I'm super picky about my nudes because they go like orange on me and I do not like that. But it is, it's definitely, it's showing up like really like orangey brown but it definitely has some pink in it. And it's really natural and pretty and the finish is like a cream. It's just. I love it. I've been wearing it a lot lately. And then going on to higher end is Bite Beauty Luminous Cream Lipstick in Musk. And I have the baby one that came in like a little Altoid sampler pack of them. I really love these formulas. They have a really good nude that's called like Ristina or something that I love. But this is a little more mauve and so it's just perfect for fall. And these are really nice and creamy. It's not too much pigment. It's the one on top. 
and it's just really nice like it will go with anything so don't have to worry and it has antioxidants in there you know if your lips need to be antioxidized and then my favorite probably my favorite like neutral fall color it's from MAC and it's cream in your coffee which is just like a really pretty mauvey pink definitely has some brown in it and it is a cream sheen formula right yes it's definitely the boldest of them all but I feel like in fall you can go bolder with neutral because you're usually wearing like darker clothes they're all really neutral and pretty and wearable and you could really wear the, these like any time of the year but I like these ones for fall in summer I'm usually wearing like tinted lip balm or something so I love these would definitely recommend picking them up and that is everything I have for you today and trying to think about what else I could do probably do favorite eye palettes for fall because that's fun yeah that's what I'm gonna do next so look for that soon and I will talk to you later bye